Right, I should be here, boys. Hey, look, nobody call me late, okay? It wasn't my fault, okay? It wasn't my fault. We were having a few technical difficulties, so I wasn't late, okay? We're here. We're absolutely here. I need to change account quickly because I'm not starting this game on my main account. Right. What is good, everybody? What's good, Colby? What's good, Queen? What's good, Jags? What's good, Liam? I think, actually, they might not have been here for a while. Let me just quickly change account. But we're here today. We're joined by... Right, well, there's no need for that, mate. No need for that, mate. Late? Oh, my God. What's good, Oscar? But yeah, we're here, boys. We're here. So, we're only doing one game today. Fun fact for you all. Um, we are only doing one singular game. Um, because, well... Why not? Seg me up for Christmas. You didn't even say the for Christmas. But, that being said, the game we are playing is, you know, Uncharted. Uncharted Drake's Fortune. We're going to race to the game. I'm confident I could beat it in two and a half hours. I'm confident. But this is where we're at. Um, so, yeah. And we are joined by the one and only Adam McDermott. Hello, Adam, mate. They can now hear you on stream. Hey. I think so. Otherwise, that'll be a bit awkward. Hey, folks. Yeah, we uh, we came to the conclusion we were just going to race oh, no. for Uncharted. <laughs> Hang on. I can't hear you. Oh, no. Oh, dear. But, okay, um, now I can hear you. Okay, hello. So we decided we were just going to race for Uncharted. You know, the best Uncharted game of, of them all, in my opinion. Yeah, nice, wholesome jank. Exactly. Now, I actually did find out there is a trophy for doing the game in two and a half hours. Is there? Yeah, there is. So we could do the continuous speed run uh, mode, obviously. Um, unless you're already in a save. There's a DLC trophy for doing it in two and a half hours, I believe. Um, no, we don't do four fits okay. here. This uh, is just for a bit of Christmas oh, fun. Buddy, I'm not sure if I can even do that. Will you give it a lash? Yeah, well, we can we can give it some time and whoever gets the furthest in said time. You know? I think you're going to win. See, a, it's like I, I like to like take my time Uncharted. with Uncharted. I know, but I take my time in Uncharted. I appreciate the game. Yeah, uh, I appreciated it the first the first three times I played it. The, <laughs> the next ten, I didn't care. But, um, <laughs> but are you are you like in the main menu or are you in a run already? Uh, there we go. So we can do a new game. Go, yeah, new game, and then. No, no bonus treasures. Yeah, no, no, no. Campaign, or do you want to do speed continuous run, speed, speed run? run? Speed run, so we've got the timer. Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> and then we're doing what? We'll, we'll uh, do just Explorer. Explorer. Yeah, because we're zooming through. Um, but yeah, we are we are absolutely doing Adam Dirt, and he's going to have to skip cutscenes, unfortunately. So, um... ah, like the best part. Uh, just click yes. Um, I don't know. Will it just start straight away after this? I don't know. But I'll do a countdown so we click yes at the same time. <laughs> we're going straight in. We're not okay. messing about here. You ready to go? Yeah, there's going to be there's going to be a delay of about five or six seconds from what folks see my gameplay. Okay, that's fine. There, there'll be a timer on the screen anyway for the game. Ah, yeah. You ready? Cool. Right. Three, right. two, one, and yo. Oh, I've got to make a save. It's fine. <laughs> <Nice. Me too. laughs> Brilliant. Right, that was a bit. Trophies are disabled. We're not really going for a trophy. We're just probably going to see who can go on furthest, really. Um. We're already in. Already skip it first. Oh, I might want to unmute the game, actually. That'd be a good idea, right? Um, oh, this feels so rough and dirty. Yeah, I didn't, you know, be going through illness as well. This is going to make it worse, isn't it? Yeah, I don't know how I got it. I think I got I don't know. Do you know, you're more um, cognizant of how you pick up illnesses since COVID. For all the, like... I used to think, oh, you got a cold, and it's just, you get a cold, and that's it. Now you realize, oh, people have germs. Oh, you go into crowds, you might end up with a cold. Yeah, me personally, I, I, I don't go outside, so I'm more, I, that's not really something I have to worry about, so. See, that's the best idea. You're like the boy in the bubble. Exactly, and, and my mum works at home as well, so I don't even have to worry about that bit. It's fine. <laughs> living. Yeah, living you live life. to 100. Well, that's a dream. So what's your strategy? Do you go for uh, melee here, or do you go for the guns? Uh, I'm a definitely a gunner, but I don't know. Do you have to do the melee for this? Um, yeah, what's good? Uh, you you want. Jags, what's good? Tom, what's good? Biggs, what's good? Leechy, what's good? Jace, what's good? Everyone. This game still looks beautiful. I like all the popping colors. They did not do a 
bad job at the remaster. You excited to play Drake's the uh, enemy. The Last of Us Two again? Oh, because of the um the remaster. Yeah. Not a feckin' chance. Oh, I'm, I can't wait. It's only it's only a ten euro update. Uh, that's that. that's grand, and the the rogue, uh, whatever it's called, that'll be pretty good for you. But, I will uh, happily uh, do those. But um, I think I'm okay. They it's they it's a story I went through. Update. Yeah, it's a story I went through twice. That that that's enough. That, that's enough. Although you know they say three times is enough to soak in the atmosphere, and. You've only uh, done it twice, so. <laughs> you know. So I, I might actually die here on Explorer. That's a bit embarrassing, actually. Yeah, I'll think about it. How are you doing? I'm checking your thing. I'm a. Uh, oh, you're ahead of me. Yeah, I'm maybe like, me. maybe a little bit. I'm just kind of. Uh, there's going to be times of this where I completely forget like what you have to do. It's my problem. Yeah, that's okay. When the guy in the gunner comes, all you do is wait for Sully. Yeah, I, I tried to take down the, the gun on myself because I'm just there. Invincible. There he is. There's Sully. I mean, said, what's your opinion on Lost Legacy, Adam? I think it's the worst Uncharted. Uh, I think Uncharted Three is the worst Uncharted. I think Lost Legacy is better. I just, it I really that... put me off that big oh. open world area that I did. That was awful. That ruined the whole game. Oh, for me. that was. That's awful. because you were going. That's that's because you were going for the trophies. Well, oh, yeah, not just for the trophies, it's still terrible. Luckily, I, if, you, I, I if like you're a bit late to, if you're late to skip a cutscene, it doesn't affect the like in-game time, so you're alright for that. So I can watch the cutscenes. Uh, if you want to, but then at the end of the two hours, I'll just be like six years ahead, really. So, um. uh, <laughs> it feels so wrong. Oh, I feel uh, that feels big open world. That big open world section for Lost Legacy, I liked. I don't know, it was kind of an expansion on what I was in Uncharted 4. I quite liked it. Uncharted 4 wasn't as bad. No, it was definitely more... I don't know why I'm going Linear. Up here. It was definitely more consigned. Or con... Where am I going? Okay. Also, you can make all your clothes wet! Dragging you down, mate. You're wasting time. I'm enjoying myself, sake. <laughs> I've played through this game. It it, it did make me realise when I was asking you how many times I've actually played through Uncharted. It has been way too many. Like the first one, the other the others like maybe like once or twice. Uncharted yeah. one, like I'm talking maybe like eight times probably. Yeah, I think I'm up there as well with you. I like the I like the gameplay the most, ironically. Really? Yeah. I'd say the gameplay of two or four is the best. I probably actually no. Two. I don't like the 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 bullet spray in Uncharted Four. I think Uncharted Two might have the best gunplay. Why do you like the combat and the general gameplay of this the most? I actually have no idea. I just think it, it's janky and it works. I also believe. I also think. I I also don't know if anything's played. I feel like everyone who I've spoke to about Uncharted says Uncharted One's the hardest on crushing and brutal. I think this is the easiest uh... of them all. There's a couple of tricky sections. I think the only the only hard section that comes to mind for me is in when you're in that water tunnel, like you know the water underground thing, and then people come from left, right, and everywhere. Yeah, that's the only like section which I find annoying. But even then, it's not really awful. Yeah, I think overall, I also this is my favorite setting. I think that's maybe why I also like Uncharted: Lost Legacies because the setting of when they get to South India and it's all lush greenery it's like this. Um, but Uncharted 1, I think, is the best setting overall. Yeah, it's just, a, just the best game. I'll stand by that until Uncharted 5 comes out. How are you already underground? What the hell? Well, on my on the share screen, I'm 30 seconds ahead of you. Like, I've played for an extra 30 seconds. All oh, right. Okay. Because you've seen the top right. My time is only 3 minutes 20. Yours is... 252. Oh, okay, now I get it. Right, let's go. Just hold it. Wow. Grand has just said this game's boring. I mean, no, this is a great game. This is a, uh, an iconic game. Let's hope this place has a back 
it's the it's the kids these days they they can't appreciate the greatness <laughs> honestly uh i saw you is the only person you've beaten is john is it <laughs> yeah oh i just okay. lose every time uh it's you'll get a sad. nice handy victory here sake i've not been 0 and 5 yet i've not been 0 and 5 yet so that's good as long as i win at least once but um you know, oh, speaking of John, he's just come in chat. <laughs> hey, John. <laughs> I will join you in the loser quarters. <laughs> oh. Okay. May have just, just uh, tumbled to first death. You died? Yeah, I missed the jump. I just jumped straight to the floor. That was enough for me. Legends only in the losers section. Yeah, well, I lose every day, so that, <laughs> that includes me, so. Oh, boy. I'm a little bit... See, when you're playing without the audio on... Also, why are subtitles on? Damn. For one... Nice point, hey, guys, you heard it first. Anyone who's ever judged me for playing with audio, I can hear the game and Adam can't. Now, who's the real one who plays with audio? Okay. Well, I'm trying to listen to you, dummy. <laughs> uh, I was trying to, like... I was just... I was just sat there waiting for him. I was about to like reply to a message, then I realised I've actually got to shoot the thing down for him to to come down. Yeah. I think. Will you just come okay, on down? Yeah, with me? Solly will. Yeah, he gotta be nice to Solly. But why are you just stood there, you silly goose? Yeah, we'll be helpful if I destroyed that. Yeah. Oh. How do I open the journal? It's a touchpad. Yeah, that ain't. There we go. See, so let, yeah, let. Duh. Yeah. Lose it, he's losing seconds there. Oh. Probably give a, probably give poor Nathan a bit of a whiplash with the amount I roll about everywhere. He's not going to be seen You're straight doing for the weeks. Pro... You're doing the pro strats, yeah. I just, I just keep pressing roll. What's the time for this game? Two hours? We'll see. I'm confident I could beat it in two hours. Whoops! See, that's exactly what I did. Exactly what I did. <laughs> <laughs> exact same thing. It's a thing. sneaky one. No, nah, we're not doing skips. We're not. We're not that crazy. Why not? We... You can skip. What can yeah, you skip? You can like. Well, there's things. When I say skip, I mean you know when you do those glitches and you can just like walk through, walk in a straight line and you end up at the end of the game in a boss fight. Oh, I wouldn't even know how to do them. Yeah, neither. But either way, I could won't be able to. Do, I think it's do, just do, not do, as fun. Do. Then it'll be like a two minute, two minute adventure. That's yeah. my favourite Drake look. What? What? Not Donut Drake? Actually, yeah. Can I put on a Donut Drake? I don't have him. Sad times. Where's Donut Drake? Naughty Dog, Victor, He's Cartoon underneath Drake. He's underneath Elena. <laughs> As Adam would say, it's the journey, not the destination. Agreed. <laughs> yeah. Deary, mate. He's got an advantage now. Yeah. Yeah. Unfortunately, I'm a. Uh, I'm on a fresh save, so I don't actually uh, have it. So, it's a bit sad, really. Oh, died. I like how they change his voice for all the. Uh... Sorry, right there. He changes voice for all the cutscenes. They lower it by an octave, so he sounds fatter. Oh, they went deep in. Oh, I'm dying again. Hey, up, JB's in chat. Hey, John. I see zooming through. Uh. 
Oh, I just feel like, weirdly, this is like the smoothest game, I think, to play. Getting somewhere. I don't know if it's just cut yeah, or what. No, the first time I showed this one, my cousins, I know we were about 14 years old and he stayed over for the night. We stayed up all night and played through the entire game. Oh, he hadn't played it before and I was like, you know, he was loving this part of the game and then two thirds in when it gets really spooky, he's like, I didn't think it could get any better, but here we are. <laughs> it's a very, uh, I remember when I first played this and I, I, just, I just got attacked by the, those things. It's like, what the flip's going on here? Okay. Gear. Man, oh, damn. Dog face. Gear. Man, mad. I, I remembered that off by heart. I didn't. I didn't even look at the symbols. <laughs> Shut up, Sang. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? You know what? That's my problem with, with Uncharted games. You know, whenever I do the the puzzles, I don't actually look at like. I don't look at the the the, the journal. I just guess until it works. Not all as great as you. Oh no. Oh. <laughs> JB so... got a drink. James is in chat. <laughs> <laughs> uh, hey James Where's, where's Sully right. gone? Excuse me mate, I need your assistant Oh yeah, I would help if I let him in <laughs> well, False on Declan Rice got unbelievable Greatest Gearman. signing in the Premier League Gearman bug face Gearman, where's the man? Come on Sully mate Man Okay, where's the bug? Whoa. Where's the face? Must be the bug. What's the goal is this? Is it to beat Uncharted 1 first? Yeah, and if we don't go to finish it, just whoever gets the furthest. Oh, you're doing very well, Zeg. I'm um, telling you, I love this game. It's the only, it's the only Uncharted I had a chance on. The rest of them, I'd have no clue. I'm, okay. I'm a very slow gamer, so... In fact, um, the other evening I started playing Red Dead 2 just for fun, see what it's all about. My brother had the disc and oh, he was yeah, watching yeah, me play and he, and he grew increasingly frustrated by how bad I was in general at games. <laughs> I died on, on multiple shootouts and he was like, how are you this bad? Like, I'm being rushed! There's, there's people, I'm not good at you this! Bet, he's probably saying that because Red Dead's got auto lock, right? Uh, like like GTA oh, sort of aimbot, where it just auto locks onto the the enemies. Yeah, but they were behind cover, and I was going for headshots. <laughs> yeah, to be fair, James makes a point. You're up against a guy who beat Uncharted for a living for a short while. Oh. <laughs> but Adam, who got the MGS2 platinum? Uh, that'd be me. Crazy. There we go. Tanya, I watched uh, Joel's video on Metal Gear Solid 1 and it just made me not want to play it, so. That's Joel cool. did MGS1, or you mean Lewis? Oh, yeah, I meant Lewis, not, not Joel. Yeah, yeah, got to mix up then. Uh, yeah, they do look very alike. Yeah, I, I was, uh, yeah, you know, very similar people. Um, but yeah, I did mean Lewis. It's because I was playing with them both the other day. Hey, look at you making friends. I know. I'm Bushido was up in there as well. It's alright time. Closest thing we'll get to Adam's bar for a while. Pretty much. I think I might be dead in the water. It's too I wanna do it in person, but it's just like it doesn't really work. You gotta be you gotta all my friends shed. are <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, shed works. Um live streaming like this works as you're in charge of everything, but anytime I try to live stream for myself, it's just a, a disaster. There's too much going on. I've yeah. done all the particular, oh man, I'm so lost. Without the audio cues, I don't know what's going on. Who needs audio? Trust me, I, play... <laughs> I played this game for a living without audio, mate. You're all right. Um, Anthony, yeah, whenever... Anthony says hello, by the way. Hello. Whenever you do um, live streaming, maybe you should run over what your OBS settings are for me, because my computer just chugs. Minor. Do you run it through this squad? 
I was going to say I'm, I may not be the best person to ask because I, uh, just last year, last Christmas, I ended up uh, upgrading my PC to get a pretty beefy PC to just run max setting streams, pretty much. So my, okay. my, my settings wouldn't exactly be the, the greatest because I also record at the same time. Well, replay buffer at the same time. Yes. So I've got like recording settings and stream settings. That's I crazy. I just died and it took me all the way back here. What the hell? Yeah, it's hard. It's it's it's, it's not just computer either. It's internet and all that. It's, it's a lot going into it. Uh, the that. internet's fine. We're we're in you know twenty first century. But uh, I run the settings through. Is it better run through your CPU or your GPU? Depends which is better. For me, I do GPU because I've got a pretty strong graphics card. But I think um, mine's only at ten fifty. It could be it could be better on your CPU depending on what it is. But if I do CPU, everything just seems to yeah. That's lag, the, like the that's entire... the thing for me. It's it's also the fact of GPU's better because I'm not playing games on my PC. It's on my PlayStation. It's just Elgato, so uh, so like yeah. you're not using your graphics card actively. Yeah. Would an eGPU help? Are you sure about that one, James, mate? Might have a few dif difficulties with that one. Losing yet? No. Oh, I'm definitely losing. Who's it? Uh, I would you are so, so, even with the 30 second buffer, you are so far ahead. Down by boat. Just for encoding on OBS? I don't know. I think I think it may not be that great, James. Hey, I'm not gonna lie, Satire's games, I'm, I'm gonna beat him. Oh, easy. See? I mean, you've got the backing of Adam, so, you know. What does that tell you? When Satire to... Mm, the day after tomorrow. Got so... There's so many people just going on. It's hard to remember dates. Notepad's cooking. Notepad's a lightsaber. Was it difficult getting... I know you mentioned you got two dropped out because of scheduling conflicts. I think... I think I think I've, I've had four dropouts in total. No. Which is sad. 20 is still... I know, uh, yeah, 20 I think, is still... Wait, no, I think I've still got... I've got 22 people, I think, coming on. Maybe 21. So, I'll just, uh, you know, skip two days. And I had a couple people just not reply. Just a bit sad. But it is what it is. Busy people and all that. Me neither, Colby. I'll be telling him every day. Remember my first time seeing the German U boat, and the game just—it just spoke to me like this is cool adventuring. Yeah, I fought that, and then ended up falling to me death three times in a row, and I said, "I don't like this game." <laughs> Sometimes it's it, the game just doesn't work, but it is a very old game, so you've got to give it credit. Uh, James has asked what's your thoughts on Red Dead Redemption 2 and if you're going to stick with it. I'm... I think I'm three hours in. It's slow. Um, it, it... You know, the, the Rockstar formula of find a person, get in a mode of transport to the thing. And in Vice City, I'm just... Well, in Grand Theft Auto, you've got the radio, but in Red Dead, you've got people talking to. The unfortunate thing is I don't find them particularly interesting. So... That's, that's when you've got to hit the mute button like a certain someone. <laughs> James has said first five hours are slow and give it till chapter three. But he also told me to platinum the game. And I'm going to be honest with you, James, there's no chance that's happening. I don't even like Red Dead Redemption 2. So to platinum, it's just ridiculous. Look how beautiful this game is, Seg. <laughs> well, no, mate, I'm skipping through it. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, so the first five hours are slow. Okay. Apparently, yeah. My brother did tell me there's said, some sort of... It's a slow yeah, start. Some but... Sort of... But yeah. But I was told the tutorial is slow. The whole mountainous stuff is slow. And I got through that and went, okay, I'm ready, I'm ready for things to pick up. And now I'm being told, actually, the next part's also slow. I'm going, <laughs> you know. When do we get to the good bits? James, they wouldn't release a single player only next year. If they were going to release a PS5 version, it would be like they did GTA, so it would get in online as well. 
online gives them the most money, so they'll just always pile it on if they can. Which makes sense. On the German U boat, like, you always gotta go to the very edge. And then you look at this and you think, my god, how is this a PS3 game? It's so beautiful. You're playing it on a PS5, mate. Uh, uh, uh. Yeah. <laughs> that helps. That being said, I'm also not wasting my time. <laughs> Can't we go into the end of boat? There's not a collectible there for me. <laughs> actually, that's a lie. There actually is one in the game, but in, in this particular moment, I don't care about collectibles, so... Nothing to worry about. RDR online is dead, though. I think RDR is dead, personally, but, I mean... Let alone the online. Thinking I might have to do a, uh, might have to to platinum Vice City before GTA Six. Well, you got enough time. I know. FIFA's dead. Oh, yeah. I agree, what, are your, what are your thoughts on the trailer? I think um, it actually worries me a little bit because I saw a crocodile roaming around, and if they do that with snakes, I'm not going to buy the game. Oh yes, I remember I can't, this. Like I can't, I can't do that. I actually, I, nah, no. I can't. That's too much. Wasn't it the second Harry Potter movie you couldn't watch? Oh, I've, I've definitely seen it now. I just had to close my eyes for a good solid time. Yeah. There's a lot. I had to. I closed my eyes during the entire Sekiro snake fight. I did not open my Oof. eyes once. So I kind of jumped on its head and was spamming buttons. And I was glad it was like, you know how it's just like the... Well, all you have to do is hit him once, really. Yeah. So I just did that. And I didn't look at him. Just watched him die and got the trophy. I was like, thank you. Yep. My brother owns two snakes. Your brother's crazy. Stay with me. <laughs> Honestly, I don't... They're like, who wants to keep a pet as a snake? Wait, what? A, a snake as a pet, even? Because, like, realistically, you could have something cool. Like, I don't know. A turtle. You know what I mean? Something that won't try and kill you in your sleep, basically. Okay, besides that, though. What do you think of the rest of the trailer? Uh, I actually thought it was really good. I think it looks unbelievable. I'd agree. Um, there are some moments when they do close-up of characters. It's like, ooh, that looks that looks good. Because you wonder how the art style from GTA Five is going to be upgraded. I think they did a good job. I was a yeah, I was a I was a big fan of uh, all the all the uh, bikinis and everything. I think they look pretty high quality as well. Um. <laughs> Did you like the jiggle <laughs> physics? <too? laughs> I, thought, I thought it was very well executed. Very realistic. <laughs> What's a turtle going to do? Turtles are cool. Put respect on turtles, man. Look at Donut Drake go! He's hustling. Have you ever seen a man this big move this quick? <laughs> oh. No, but I'd pay to see it. <laughs> Hey, for the record, John, your Lego Harry Potter video got turned off not because of the Lego snake, but because you actually put the snake in there thinking you were funny, mate. So uh, that's why I turned your video off. I couldn't watch that. It's about to cry, mate. You're not watching. Oh, Jesus, I died. You're not watching John's videos? That's deplorable sake. Hey, no, I watch, I watch them if he doesn't put a snake in them. But he uploads less than you these days, so... <laughs> you know, and he, he does the replay buffer thing, so I'm not really sure what's going on in that front. Yeah, I'd, um, I think I've gone the wrong way. Oh, I've definitely gone the wrong way. Oh, cool! I didn't know this! You've just been bombarded. So if you go the wrong... Yeah, if you go the wrong way, they'll put a wall of enemies and you can't get by them. Even on Explore. That's very cool. I didn't know that. Still learning new stuff about the game all these years later. Yeah. Me personally, I only know the story route. Check Discord. Uh, no, mate, because I, I, I'm already on Discord, so I can't do that. You're also getting blocked, yeah. mate. Also, I, I, I might have gotten lost. You go back through the cave you came in from. Yeah, thank you very much. 
It's like, why, why are we going? See, I'm not watching the cutscenes, so I don't know what's going on. <laughs> oh yeah, I'm not. I'm not watching the cutscenes either, pal. <laughs> um, I might have forgotten. What's to reload? R one. R one. Thank you very much. Great, great. And, and what a random button! I still think to this day. Yeah, you've never actually. There we go. Did you just realise like how much of like aim assist you get on this difficulty? Yeah, and how much you can just run by dudes? Yeah, pretty much. Are you guys looking forward to any games coming out next year? Um Ooh, what's coming out this year? Or next year? What is coming out next year? I have no idea. <laughs> I'm, I'm I mean, almost, gonna... I know how you were. Go on. Oh, I was just gonna say I'm gonna I'm gonna just just troll at him a little bit and sit here and reply to a message like the timer play oh you can i think you got time i'm zigzagging i'm riding like the wind can you actually die from combat oh i might be i yeah, might you die can. you definitely can you definitely can <laughs> oh i might have made it i might have made it <laughs> <laughs> Oh! <laughs> okay, come on, recover there, Drake. Come on, recover you, you dingus. He's good, he's good, he's good. Bro's getting cocky. Right, what other opportunity do I ever have to win something? You know what I mean? Let me let me embrace the moment. <laughs> if, it, if it's in five games, man, I can't do it. Because bloody... Oh, three-point gamer robbed me blind. I'm, I'm actually still furious at that. Why, what did he do? Honestly, so we obviously the, the way I normally do it is we pick two games each, right? And then like so each person has an advantage for two games. So I chose Mortal yeah. Kombat 10. And the, the goal yeah. was to complete the tower. And I've worked out this whole thing on how to kill the AI really quickly on very easy. So this was my own game, right? And he forced me to play on hard. He was like, no, we're not playing on easy. We're not doing that. We're just not doing it. We're playing on hard. So I had to play on hard in which my method wouldn't work because the AI was too good for me and I couldn't hit them. So oh, I got man. like rigged out of my own game. That's not on that, I don't think. Oh yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? That That's not on. Like, I, I keep saying it's a speed run. Why does it have to be difficult? When I speed run a game, I put it on Explorer. You know what I mean? I get you. Yeah, yeah. And then I also got robbed from a Minecraft trophy as well. That wasn't on that. That, that did my in as well. We, we did a race with first a set of iron armor, and I popped the trophy first, but um, he got the iron set first. So chat was like, nah, 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 he got it first, but I actually got the trophy and he didn't. So um, I think I was rigged out of that one as well. What I'm hearing, it's, like, it's not a lot of excuses. I'm going to take my loss well and wish you the best. I'm hearing off a lot of excuses from you. Is this Adam's prep for doing the Uncharted race against Lucy? Ah, she's gonna. I'm gonna bug the shit out of her, but she's definitely gonna beat me. Is there, My is only there hope... no update on when that's happening? Is it just. Well, fortunately. Mm... Is she still in the state? No, no, she's on her way back. Oh, I keep seeing. I, I yeah. kept seeing all the um, Instagram pictures everywhere. Oh, yeah, it's really cool. She went to Vegas, which she was, she was uh, telling me she was so excited about. Yeah, she was at the Sphere. I was like, golly gosh. Yeah, I said, you better do a, in real life like a vlog video about that. Did she? Uh, it's a good question. I'll ask her. I think I'm speaking to her next week. I saw. <coughs> I saw she was a. Uh, she was complaining that she had to boil her own water on the stove because the Americans don't have a kettle. I learned that a while ago, and it still boggles my mind. There's no kettles in America. Yeah, it does seem a bit stupid, actually. Yeah, honestly. Why, like, why does no one ever need to boil water? So, like... You know what? Yeah, now I think love... about it... Sorry to cut you off, but that's probably why they, like, think we drink tea so weirdly. Well, maybe not maybe not in Ireland, but... They think we drink tea so much, and they think it's weird because they have to sit and take 15 minutes to make their tea. It only takes us two. Yeah. And for them, it's a big ordeal. Ah, oh, Jesus. I died! <laughs> I just did as well. <laughs> That didn't sink so much. <laughs> um, 
But yeah, it's you pop on the kettle, it takes less than one minute. If even. Badoo! Am I gonna keep making excuses? Yeah, but I won't have to against you, Sasai, because you're gonna get five and eight, my friend. So it's fine. What's good, Josh? What's good, Scott? Oh, no, I've just killed myself again. Oh, for Christ's sake. That's the janky jumping, that is. Mm -hmm. Plus, do they even have Yorkshire gold? Mate, I'd be a bit concerned if they had Yorkshire anything in America, to be fair. My poor Drake has taken a beating. Do you play many new games apart from the yearly releases, you know, the FIFAs and F1s? Uh, it depends. Uh, Call of Duty every year. Um, uh, but, um, I played Spider-Man 2 on launch. Um, I platinum that. I'm just not releasing the video for like, you know, another six years because everyone else has done it. Um, what was... It's mostly if I'm just really excited for it, to be honest. I, I, I was excited to play Avatar, but I don't know if I'm going to buy it. I don't think that kind of That kind of snuck up on us, didn't it? I saw a, yeah. a YouTube ad for it and went... It's coming out in three days. Yeah, I was looking forward to it because it looks like one of those like mindless grinding games which look kind of okay. And I don't mind those games, but it's also a lot of money and I've just spent everything on Christmas and Black Friday. So I just don't want to do that. But um, but games I'm extremely excited for, like Hogwarts Legacy, I'll just do. Yeah. Is that still your game of the year? Yeah, 100%. Not, nothing's even close. Damn. I, I went and replayed it like uh, yesterday with Bushido because we did a race of the sorting hat and it just it yeah. just made me remember that that game is just oh, man. actually unbelievable I'm going to re-platinum it just in my own time for fun whoa that's a big compliment Hogwarts Legacy mid that's a bannable offence I think <laughs> <laughs> to be honest that's unbelievable And it didn't even get a single Game of the Year nomination. Nothing's... I don't normally care for Game of the Year, but to not get a single nomination, that's a joke. That's unbelievable. Uh, so I... Uh, do you know, you know, Adam Hood? Yeah, yeah, Platinum Adam. That's it, yeah. So, uh, did he ask you to do your Game of the Year for him? Uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So the only game from this year I'd actually played that was released this year was Resident Evil 4 Remake. And so that's by default my pick. But I'm thinking not even, not even the top half of the best games I've played this year, in my for my personal taste. Yeah. Oh, I did play Resident Evil Four on launch actually because Sean bullied me into it, and I'm not gonna I... lie. I think I personally believe that that shouldn't get in. Um, that shouldn't be a game of the year attend a uh, contender. Is it just because it's a remake, or just yeah, in general? Because it's a remake. I, I disagree with that. I... I because I think it's squad. I think it shouldn't it shouldn't get in over something that's completely brand new because even though the game was good it was a very good remake right the problem is is that the characters are there the story's there everything's there already as a base foundation compared to something like Hogwarts Legacy which is a brand new open world like there, there's a lot of effort gone into one and um, so you, you might have shot yourself in the foot there Hogwarts is an already existing IP with films and books and no 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 it's, it's a standalone it's story. It's it's a it's a whole different story in open world. The the world around it is Hogwarts is isn't new, but the world around it is. Mm. I think, but Resident Evil Four it's already there. I think the gameplay in the remake is so different that it it's its own game. I also thought it was the exact same as Resident Evil Two. Uh, I think I, I don't know. It was really difficult playing Resident Evil Four original and then playing the remake back to back because I think the combat in the original is so much better and so much more satisfying. The whole bullet sponge enemies and on higher difficulties, you can land up to three headshots before they stagger, but they move really quickly, so it becomes tricky to actually play well. And not messy, so you end up resorting. Well, I end up resorting just using the shotgun. I I don't feel good. I know, but I don't feel good. I don't feel like I'm doing well. Oh, and then the breakable knife drove me fucking nuts. <laughs> Why would you 
take one of the best mechanics it had and make it breakable. Ugh. I know. I'm on professional now going for S plus and It's for uh, the remake. Yeah, I'm just shambling through it. Yeah, I don't know. I, I just also I just I uh, don't know. Hogwarts Legacy is great, mate. You know what I mean? I've just killed myself. Oh, like not. That's what I just did then. Walked into a walked into a trap almost and it almost took me out. Hey, there's nothing wrong with replaying the first the first four sections of Hogwarts Legacy. They all had different stories, it's fine. Adam asks you too, but the only games he's played is Kong and Gollum. Good enough options. Yeah. <laughs> Nothing wrong with that, mate. Nothing wrong with that. Couple of bangers. I just, I just it's haven't got around to them. I totally plan to play them, and it's not the fact that the, the games aren't good enough for me to play. It's just, uh, you know, just timing. Just, you know. Bye. Have you ever played Gravity Rush, Adam? I haven't, but I've heard good things about it. Whoa! There was Drake. I I died on that waterfall about three times. But no, I, I'm, I'm here to tell you, Gravity Rush is still probably the worst game I've ever played. The worst. It's so bad. So bad. Why is it so bad? Everything. There's not a single good thing about that game. I tell you, God. I think John would agree with me as well. John John made a video on it, and he did not look happy yet at all playing it. Worst tasting games. Days Gone, nothing's wrong. Nothing's worse than that. Okay, Days Gone is a good game. And I can't wait to... Also, I'm playing Days Gone against Satire. <laughs> Force him into it. Does Days Gone not suffer from the old open world fatigue and all that sort of stuff? Uh, Sort of, but like... For me, I don't think it's that big of a problem because like realistically it, it depends how much cleanup you do yeah the collectibles the collectibles are the only bad thing about that game because you do have to drive around on your bike but you also do have a pretty cool bike feeling like daryl dixon all the time do you think the game would have been better off to put the horde much closer to the beginning I think it's fine. I think that the whole game's fine, personally. I think the only I think the only reason people genuinely hate it is that it had a really bad launch. Yeah. You know, like you know when people get sour experiences because of the launch being bad and they don't go and play it when it's fixed. Mm -hmm. It had a, such a bad launch. Then after the launch and they fixed it, it was really good. It's a bit like it's basically like Cyberpunk. How? T oh, I died again. <laughs> Were you going to say something, or how did you vault? Um, it was on the waterfall when... I don't know, you're meant to just make a simple jump. Yeah, there I go. Oh yeah, no, I keep... I, the amount of times I just roll off the edge on that section. Yeah, that's tricky. Cyberpunk come back from the dead. Yeah, but Days Gone hasn't had a PS5 remake to come back from the dead. Now, that's, a, that's what I want to see. A PS5 Days Gone. Mm. Now we're coming up with ideas, chat. Here, can we take a quick uh, 30 seconds? I need to get a tissue for my nose. Yeah, sure, mate. I can, I can sit for 30 seconds. No worries. Yeah, Adam's a bit, Adam's a bit uh, unwell. Chat battling an illness, you know. And he's still on here. What a guy! Straight on TikTok. I wasn't on TikTok. I was on Snapchat. Um, missions are so boring. Colby, I'm actually starting not to like you, mate. Um, day's gone. I didn't give it enough time to enjoy it. Took too long to start. Then driving across the entire map. Nothing wrong with a bit of driving. To be fair, I sit and play. I've played like 170 hours of F1. So. See, you know what, Adam? Adam, mate, you've got some absolutely fantastic 
uh, gaming knowledge. I, I love Adam S, mate. What a guy he is. He always comes in with the greatest, greatest takes on games. If Adam likes a game, I bet I like it at this point. Hogwarts is mid. Hogwarts is better than mid. Hogwarts is unbelievable. What were you saying about me? Oh, I was talking about Adam S. You know, handsome Adam? Oh, yeah. He shares my gaming opinions every single time. I'm telling you. Anytime I say something, he's uh, saying the same thing. What a guy. All right, thanks for the break. I was, uh, I was starting to leak. No worries. All right, I'll count us down. Um, three, two, one, go. Yeah, no. Yeah, it, 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 it wasn't McDermott, guys. Don't worry. wasn't uh, wasn't giving him the praise. <laughs> also, I just died again. <laughs> <laughs> what? This is what I mean. That's, this is the. This is where this game suffers. Is the parkour? The amount of times you just like you just drop. No sign of you. Trying to do a simple jump. It's a lot less stressful just playing one game, though. I'll say that. Switching between games is, is actually quite stressful. You normally do five, isn't it? Yeah. Can I grab this bag, please, game? Thank you. Yeah, five How games. How is there a trophy possible. for just two and a half hours? That's not possible. Oh, I've, I've done it before, mate. I'm gonna do it right in now. under two and a half hours? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think I did it in like an hour 50 once. What? It's, it's not as bad as it sounds. But we're only on, what are you on, chapter four? Five, I think. Is this five? I don't know the chapters of this game like that. I believe the fortress is chapter six. Harry Potter was great. The biggest you had from playing Hogwarts was the characters you create, or always so middle class and posh. Isn't that the like whole point of Harry Potter now? <laughs> the best of British. Yeah, that's why it's British, guys. Come on. This is trophy for doing. It is one of those. Yeah, it is. yeah, it is one of those things where it could only exist in Britain. I don't think that that type of world. Yeah, imagine be as that. If it was imagine American. A, an American Harry Potter. No thanks, mate. Oh, they got baseball. some Irish, Welsh, and Scots in yet. Yeah, but I mean, it's in the UK. And the only UK play. I mean, it's filmed in Scotland, no? I think. Ooh. Bit embarrassing if it's. Ah, gone. bollocks. Oh, I'm gonna die. Oh, I'm definitely gonna die. Oh, I'm definitely gonna die. I'm just going <laughs> through it. But it's a... Uh, it's filmed all over. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It has filmed in Scotland, mate. I think. Like the train tracks and that. That's Scotland, no? Because there's like a there's like a a tour you can do around the UK for all the Harry Potter places. But for me personally, I'll just go Harry Potter world. I I, I ain't asked to travel to Scotland. Bloody hell! Why would I go up there? Or is it down there? You said that, you said that with such disdain. <laughs> like, nothing against it's the Scotland. Scots, but, you know, I'd rather stay in England, you know what I mean? <laughs> is it a private school? I mean, to be fair, is it, Hogwarts technically is a private school, no? You only get in if you get invited. The beach where Dobby okay, is. Okay, where are you? I'm in the this ocean, this bit, wherever this is. Watch your tongue when you mention Scotland, James. Why are you saying that as if you're Scottish? <laughs> He's all up there in Liverpool. He's close enough. Ugh. Even worse. Oh hell. Because I am. I There's no way. <laughs> James gonna, is definitely that. not from Scotland. And if he is from Scotland, Art? you're the least Scottish sounding person I think I've ever met from Scotland. Oh, 
Remember Resident Evil 5 got a bunch of hate for being in Africa. Africa should yeah. Yeah, that's I just noticed, you know, didn't Uncharted seemed to get away with it, didn't it? <laughs> yeah, but but they're not zombies. Come on. <laughs> Harry Potter, that's the one with the light swords and little green frog dude, yeah. Pretty much. Oh, I've just reached chapter six, so I was in chapter five. Oh, nice. Dun, 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 dun. I am way behind. I used to hate this on Crushing, because you get shot at the end of the cutscene when you can't do anything. Makes no sense. Yeah. So stupid. It... Both set of grandparents are Scottish and dad is. Yeah, but, but that doesn't make you Scottish. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> the question the question is, James, where were you born, mate? Where were you born, is the question. God's sake. <laughs> I'm making the point. <laughs> Scottish blood. Yeah, that makes... Right, so I'm not, I've got Irish blood. I'm not going to say I'm Irish. You know what I mean? Sega's now in charge of immigration and national identity. Honestly. I mean, hey, hey, hey. hey. I'm actually being serious here as well. You... you just because, like, a family member was born in Scotland doesn't mean you're Scottish. That, that, that's not how the world works. I don't think. Gosh, they really make you pressure. Born in a little Scotland town... Born in little Scotland, a town in England. So it's, you, you shot yourself in the foot there, James, because you said, in England. Oh, for Christ's sake. I think James should be allowed to say he's from wherever he wants. 80% Scottish population. Yeah, and you're in the 20% of the British, mate. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> right. I hate this parkour section. I can never do it. Scotland and England. That's what I'm saying. Thanks, Adam. Likewise, my fellow Welshman. Right, well, that's just mean. I like Wales. Yeah, but you're also from the best country in the world. So... It is, it is a bit of a... If Adam was born in Scumthorpe, would he be English? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, he would. Because the point is, he was born in Scumthorpe. This sure, where... it has an unfortunate name, but it might be a nice place. This is where this is where I'll... Um, this is where someone tells you Scumthorpe isn't actually in England. I think it is. It's an awful place. No one wants to be up there. Big up Wales. I like Wales. Can't have ever, ever. I did like the uh, the the um, educating Cardiff. That's a good TV show. That. That's all I know of Wales. My college film teacher was from Scunthorpe. Give them my best wishes. It is a very unfortunate name for a place, Scunthorpe. Wales is when sound. They... Cardiff gave us the gave us new Doctor Ho Who. Hmm. You a Doctor Who fan? Well, uh, am I a Doctor Who fan? I would say so, yeah. I kind of fell into it during the second half of David Tennant's era. And some, of the stuff, some of the stuff is very stupid, but some of it's pretty cool and interesting and sci-fi. And Obviously, they got a budget that they got to work around, but uh, some stuff is very cool. I personally think The Adventures of Sarah Jane is better. I uh, haven't watched it, but now I'm kind of curious. Why do you think like, it's better? Uh, because it's not Doctor Who. Fair enough. Do they have the Daleks and the bloody Cybermen? Because I hate them, but a passion. Um, I actually think they do have the Daleks, I think, actually. I saw them in an episode. They have that, they have that green alien-looking thing. They have those. They've got a lot of those. Uh, that's my big pet peeve at Doctor Who. Any time an episode features them, I just roll my eyes and go, this what, the is green so people? Or what? Uh, Wait, what? Uh, the Daleks and the Cybermen. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I think they do have those. Sarah Jane Adventures used to bang, right, James? God, what a! It, it was it used to be on on a UK kids channel back in the day, back when I was a, a wee kid. It's a good time that. Okay, I am. Um... 
Oh, this is, I this will is say another this... annoying section here. Wait, what were you saying? Yeah. This is the single worst way to play this game. What, speedrunning? <laughs> speedrunning and muted. <laughs> it's just... Guys, he, he knows he knows what it's like to be me every day. I kid you not. Oh, no, this is literally like what I did for so for like I think it was like throughout my entire two years at college, I would like speedrun trophies in games, muted, and watch TV. Well, watch Netflix. That was like what my life was. Yeah. Did mean college work never got done, but not the point. I still passed somehow. So it's all good. Were there ever any games that you went, okay, this one, I'll listen to? <laughs> Probably not. <laughs> no, I can think of. no, it was, it was never. It was never that I didn't want to listen. It was always the problem of, um, at the time, I had a, I had an old Elgato, so everything was delayed, and I just can't play with delayed audio. Like it was so much better playing with no audio than me shooting and hearing it three seconds later. It was so bad. But ever since I upgraded my Elgato to a newer one, and everything was like in sync, I've never turned off audio since. Unless, unless oh. I'm playing something like a sports game and I'm watching something like, who needs who needs to hear when I've scored a goal when I when I bloody put it in the net? You know what I mean? So stuff like that, I'll, I'll mute. But like right now, I've got it coming through an audio mixer, so I can just hear it alongside everything else. So it works. Because the only way before, if I wanted to listen without delay, I'd have to plug my headset into my PlayStation controller, which meant I didn't have uh, my PC audio. So it was all just a mess. But now I've got an actual setup. It's all good in the hood. What's the episode you're working on next? Oh my At god. The moment, I've died on this bloody thing about five times. It's so bad. <laughs> But um, that, to be honest, it's given me a, it's given me a hint of a fucking platforming. <laughs> Go on anyway. Should uh should have got an Adam to do a shovel knight speed run. Nah, because that that doesn't count, mate. Because I've never played it, so that would have been a bit unfair. I want. Yeah, also... We were only doing one game, so I wanted it to be one we've both played and we're both familiar with. Yeah. But um, as I was saying, the the video I'm working on next, I actually. I am supposed to be like editing at the moment. Well, not like right now, but as a whole. But I've just been doing so many of these that I'm just trying to chill. Yeah. Throughout the day and just relax a bit. Uh, but that being said, next video will most likely be Gravity Rush. Ooh, but you just well, complained about it. Yeah, that's why I was complaining about it because I did it. It's terrible. But uh, that being said, I've got a video coming out, a collab video coming out on Christmas Eve. So I'm, if I get that lazy and I don't edit Gravity Rush before, then that'll be the next video. What's the collab? Uh, it was a uh, it was a platinum race. Funny enough, um, first to platinum the Grinch. Ooh, that's kind of cool. It was a it was a brilliant brilliant two hour experience that I will never ever get back. What? <laughs> it was, it's, 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 you know those really bad like cheap platformer games with easy platinums it was basically one of those but i wanted like a christmas video so i did okay. uh we did us we did a grinch speed run in the middle of november <laughs> jeez who did it yourself and josh ij josh ah yes oh to be fair now, now i'm speaking of him probably shouldn't say anything bad on welsh oopsies Oh my god, just make the jump. Actually, can you check stats? Bonuses. There we go. I want to see if it has how many times I've died. <laughs> oh no, I won't. No, oh, it's just kind of yeah, yeah, it's from all your save. Now, this section is the worst section in the game for speedrunning because you can never see where I'm actually jumping to. Like the camera. Whoever made the camera for this one particular jumping section, I actually do <laughs> pressure just everything. Because, like, what? <laughs> how am I supposed to know where I'm off here? It's literally just this one oh, section. Oh, I died. Or he just doesn't want to jump. You know what, Nathan? I wouldn't either, to be fair. Okay, where are we going? Oh, oh, brilliant! Can't, oh, might be here for it for a couple hours on this one jump. Yes. 
Timothy's asked us both. Oh. What's what's our favourite movie? Oh, I didn't even make the jump. Oh, I just um... gave you the checkpoint. Sweet. Huh. How do you do grenades? Okay. Um, you can go first, Sig. I actually, I actually don't think I have a favourite movie. Like one favourite movie, but probably uh, top three would definitely be Harry Potter and the Goblet of Fire. Um, nice. Uh, funny enough, Gran Turismo came out this year. And um, right. probably a movie called Super 8. Oh, no, actually, 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 Real Steel and then Super 8. Real Steel is such an unbelievably good movie no one's ever heard of. Sue Jackman, fight Yeah, robots. exactly. It's so good. That movie is... I actually remember last time I watched it, I started crying. Look at you, having emotions. No, I, honestly, I, I remember I sat there and I was watching it. I was like, this movie's so good. I was literally just crying with happiness. I actually don't even know why. But I get, I get very emotional at movies. Me, I, I, the, amount, the last three cinema visits I've been, I've cried every time. <laughs> I only went to watch, I only went to watch Toy Story Four, How to Train Your Dragon Three, and the bloody Maze Runner Death Cure. You know what I mean? I didn't, didn't watch any yeah. like sad movies. It was just... <sighs> Toy Story Four. Yeah, me. I don't know, we, girl's like a sensitive guy. I think it'll work out for you. What did uh, what were you about to say, Matt? About ways you run it? Doesn't strike me as a movie that you, that you would get sad at. Nah, honestly, no, no. With the, like, people die, man. People die. Maze Runner. Yeah, Maze Runner Death Cure, the third one. People die, man. And I actually think the way they actually did the death was one of the saddest deaths I think I've ever seen in a movie. It was actually like traumatizingly sad. It's crazy. But that being said, John is right. Coronation Street is definitely the best TV show ever. I I, I can't say it's oh, my favorite movie because it's not a movie, but it's a TV show. So yeah. I forgot about your undying love for Coronation Street. You still oh, watch it great. day to day? Oh, I watch it. I watch it. I watch the. Um, the modern Corrie every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. And then every day I watch two episodes of classic Coronation Street from 2004. <laughs> I love that you have a schedule. Well, it's just what, whenever they show it on TV. Because they're doing like they're doing like uh -huh. two episodes a day on TV these days. So I watch, uh, I watch those. Because it used to be classic Coronation Street. But now we reach 2004. It's now just Coronation Street. It's not classic anymore. So I am not a classic kid, apparently. You're Coronation Street masters. ass. Now that genuinely is pushing a ban. That's unbelievable. That's a stupid <laughs> comment to put in my chat. <laughs> Terrible. Terrible. You're getting harassed, Zegu. Honestly. They just, don't, they just don't know good TV when they see it. That's all. I understand. I was like that once. Super 8 banged. That's a great movie that I feel like not many people know about. Like, last time I mentioned it, I think the only person who had seen it that I spoke to was uh, Michael. That was it. Yeah, Michael was the only. Wasn't player. it? Um, is it Spielberg that did that, or who yeah, was it? it is. Yeah. Good movie. Oh, I've just died. I've seen Super oh. Eight. Good man, John. Good man. I'm in the blue room. Not in years, mind. Oh, I thought I thought you said not in years mid. I was gonna say there's no way you just said that. No, nah, I watched it like last year. Good, good movie. Good movie. Boodoosh. How long ago did you do the blue room? It's a really tricky one. Um, probably, <laughs> I want to say about 20 minutes ago. <laughs> I can tell I'm in the car chase at the moment. <laughs> Fine. It's not about it's not about the winners and losers. It's all about Christmas fun. You know, we're here just for yeah, for, just for for collaborations. You know, I enjoy doing a collab whenever I can. Are you doing about twenty of them? Yeah, <laughs> twenty-two. <laughs> so many, so so many. Who's the full list? Um, bloody hell! I I I know. Uh, Joel, Lewis, and Steve are supposed to be on that. Are they uh, doing one each? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, 
Joel was actually supposed to be on the ninth, but he had to pull out for reasons. So he'll be in the foreseeable future. I think Study was supposed to be on yesterday. Study V2. But he had to, uh -huh. he's having power issues, so he had to pull out. Um, uh, Godlike Matt had to pull out. But I've got, that being said, I've got Nick coming on. Um, nice. So that's nice. Can't wait to lose that. I've had like three point gamer and satires coming on. A bit of a small guy. No one's ever heard of him, but you know. <laughs> uh, first day work experience in gardening. Good luck, mate. Don't don't like cut yourself on some um, stinging nettles. Who's winning? Uh, I think me only just. Yeah, only just. I like Adam's your, on. How modest. Yeah, Adam's one of them as well. If you didn't know that, Adam's 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 coming on. Bit of Adam's a uncharted. Lost. A little bit of uncharted. It does feel so wrong and dirty not watching <laughs> any cutscenes. It's fine, you've seen them enough. I know, but it's been a while. Should do what I do and just watch watch it on YouTube after. What are your thoughts about the uh, a new Uncharted game? Uh, I honestly wouldn't care if we did or didn't personally, but I mean, it'll run nicely and play nicely. I just hope it's not like Lost Legacy and I'll be fine. What did you think of uh, Chloe and Nadine as lead characters? They were fine. I feel like it, it worked well. I just, I'm just not a fan of the game itself. <laughs> That's all. Fair enough. Just one of those. It's all preference, really. I don't think Nathan Drake has to be uncharted. You know what I mean? You okay? So you'd be okay with uh, for the end of Uncharted Four if it went in that direction? Yeah. Yeah. Totally, I don't mind. I'm I'm here for I'm here for I should be blown up. I'm here for a fun time on a game. You know? I don't think If if it was if they would have just uh, left it at four, I think I probably would have said that I would keep it at Nathan, but since they've already done a spin off like at this point it just doesn't really matter anymore. Mm. All open for it. That being said, if they if they wanted to do a Last of Us three without Ellie, I'd tell them to stop immediately. Well, they're doing it without Joel, so. I wonder why that is. Uh... <laughs> but yeah, but but there's there's an obvious reason on why Ellie can be there. Um... I don't know. To me, to me, Last of Us is Ellie and Joel, and without one of those, it, I I very my interest is definitely waning. Yeah, that's what I mean. If if it's just like a, a full Abby thing, like no thanks. Hmm. I want I want like I didn't like Abby sections at all. Me personally. Last of Us it's is quite long. Last of Us Part Three is coming. It's already coming. So like, come on, guys, let's be honest. And it's not a dead series. The Factions game is going to be sick. I really hope that it does actually come out. They when they were initially talking about it, they said how they were going to try and what was the question why can't multiplayer games have a good story and i went yeah that, i'm that sounds cool put a story in a multiplayer game i might play it yeah they totally like they totally overshot how much resources it would take though yeah they just thought That's hey we had factions in the first last of us yeah they they, yeah, they, they just they didn't write it off. They're just like pulling back some resources. That's all. They're pulling back some members, which is fine. They'll just be delayed a lot. If we see it at all, who knows? I hope so. They are think it taking. Plays well. oh. It does. They're taking quite long in between releases, aren't they? Yeah. As a studio that size, on chart. Oh, sorry. Last was part two, two thousand and twenty. So now we're going to two thousand and twenty-four. That's why they got the remake, though. Last was a remake. And then last was two remastered. Yep. 
Have you ever played a way out? Imagine... On a, question. a way out. Yeah. No, no. I haven't. I would like to at some point. I would love to actually save it for an in-person video. Yeah, that'll be fun. Like, couch, couch co-op. Yeah, yeah. Probably the best way to play it. Because the, the thing is with it, even if you're like not with each other, it's still split screen anyway, so you may as well just be with each other. Mm. Um, when was the last time you both raged at a game? Uh, I raged really badly when I played Gravity Rush. Not since then. Uh, I think two days ago, Resident Evil 4 shooting gallery. <laughs> At one point, I'm saying, like, I don't care. I don't value this. I've, uh, I've, yeah. uh, I've had a rough time with the remake. So did I, if it makes you feel any better. I had a terrible time. At least at least when what you did you it, like? though. At least when you did it, you didn't do the extra playthrough, and then as soon as you close the game, the mercenary mode comes out, meaning that whole playthrough was basically a waste of time. <coughs> ah, so this is where we differ. I have no interest in mercenary mode. Yeah, but the the thing is, for me, for me, right, I wanted to obviously make the video on it. So I did the professional new game. So not like, you know, new game plus, just professional new game to get the mm -hmm. um, the hand cannon. And then they went yeah. and and then they went and said, um, like, literally, as I finished that hand cannon run, mercenaries came out where if you finish it, you get the hand cannon. Which obviously is a lot shorter and a lot less difficult. So, is Mercenaries just, you know, gunplay and getting a high score? Pretty much, yeah. Yeah, I hate that. But it does also stop you doing a whole new professional new game. I don't know. Gosh, I think the combat. Free to shoot. Uh, what, in Resi yeah. Fort? Yeah. I think, uh, in my opinion, it's a bit slow. But, I mean, um, that's fine. I hated the the it, it got stupid on the higher difficulties. The game was just stupid. Like, I got I got um you know that section really early into the game, um when you have to like get the the part for the crank, so you have to go through that little village thing. Do you know yeah. what I'm talking about? Yeah, I was I was stood up there, um, and I got sniped from a tomahawk from the big gate when I was on a roof. Like. It was ridiculous. It's hard to explain what I mean, but like, it, it was like the most unbelievable you you've ever seen in your life to hit me. It was like rigged. It was unbelievable. And I couldn't believe my eyes. It, is this the first time you meet the bull enemy? Uh, no. No, this is like, oh. like literally the area you go to after you first meet the, um, the shopkeeper guy. Oh my god, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Oh, Dynamite Valley. Yeah. Um, I so no, from that yeah. gate, you know when you go like you go through the gate and then you go the place above the gate basically where you have to go to get the, the yeah. item you need. I was stood up yeah. there and an enemy was stood underneath me at the gate and threw a perfect U Tom and hit me. At yeah, that point, that I was like, fire. "That's ridiculous!" What I have just watched. Yeah, so that ridiculous. that section is. I don't know. It's so strange, you know, do it when I did. Resi 4 original professional and it's just so satisfying to play it and then yeah, you do it on the remake and you go this is just annoying yeah I'm all for a challenge but I'm I'm not for like it being not a challenge but just a joke I hate how inconsistent it is telling when an enemy will stagger yeah that's true I just hated yeah. how some of the enemies were like those bloody flying things man oh my um, god yeah I think they call them the Vista doors, but uh, I call them a pain in my ass. Aha, ha, ha. Same. That the, and I hate that. I hate those blooming things with the blades that you have to shoot in the back. I hate those things. It's like, why do I have to like depend on an enemy being able to turn around for me to shoot them? Because half the time <laughs> you just never turned around. Um, I don't know how you feel, but I'm very much looking forward to. I'm going to do Resident Evil 5, but that'll be old school gameplay. I'm looking forward to that. Resident Evil 6 is going to be mental, but I'm really looking forward to... I've never played the 6, 7... Sorry, 7 or 8. I'm really looking forward to getting that style I'm, of gameplay. I'm, I'm really excited to see you do 8. 
Because five, Goddamn. five was five used to be my first, uh, my favorite Resident Evil until I, until eight came out. I love eight. I think eight's the best Resident Evil game still. Why? Right. It's unbelievably good. I just look everything about that game is just brilliant. I think the the yeah. enemies, the world, everything, the gunplay. I think that entire game itself is a perfect game. I think. Wow, great. I, I couldn't. I couldn't really say anything bad about it. Other than, well, so, I say that some of the fights are annoying on a harder difficulty, but that's just every single Resident Evil. So I, I, I won't hold, yeah. hold that against it. But as a whole, I think Resident Evil 8 is definitely the best Resident Evil game all around. Appreciate you stopping by, Reapers. Apologies for uh, uh, not doing? reading chat much. Uh, you know, we're trying to run and talk at the same time. Okay, there we go. <laughs> You know, and you've got what, oh, like, oh. four years until you do eight? Yeah, uh, I'm... I am almost finished Resident Evil 4 HD. I was... The episode will at least be 30 minutes long. Uh, I still have a few you... more sections to do. Damn. Yeah, it, there's actually it, That's a... a bonus episode, right? Yeah, there's no platinum in it, but yeah, yeah, uh, it's gonna be like a nice. It's probably one of the the happiest episodes I've made, <laughs> and the most fun I've had making episodes. I don't, I don't really get angry at any point. It's just yeah, got killed there. <laughs> it's just, it's just fun. Love that. I'm so excited for the witch episode. Yes, that's. I think it's like 15 minutes that one done. So I think what I want to do is uh, I'm hoping I'm leaving Friday do family stuff. So I'm hoping to have actually Resident Evil 4 done, HD done. Well, you're a patron, so you get it like at least Friday. And then oh. next week finish recording Resident Evil 4 remake and then just do purely post-production on Witcher 3 for the rest of the year and not record anything new. Damn. Dedication yeah. to the Witcher. It's, it's just been fucking... I started recording it in December of last year. <laughs> yeah. I'm very much, you yeah. know, I think it's time. Um, also, you know, people will stop. Hey, when's Witcher 3 coming out? Uh, sometime. <laughs> I'm excited for that because I personally like... I like games that I just know I won't play myself. Like, I have no interest to play yeah. The Witcher personally. So, watching yeah. a episode on that will be good. Oh my god. I'm so over dying in Uncharted. <laughs> I keep trying, I keep jumping and the game just doesn't jump, so I just fall to my room yeah. there. Yeah, and I'm, I'm generally the game. Look at that. Like, I definitely want to. <laughs> yeah, let me check out your thing. Oh. He just, he's too slow to make the jump. <sighs> I can see what Jimmy in about. Uh, yeah, you're going people up. are going to start asking for the DLC. Oh. Yeah, he stops, on, <laughs> he stops on the stair and he can't jump. Yeah, I saw it there. Um, The DLC, what's... There's one of the DLC in the Witch that is a new area. I think that looks... That might it's like get, the Blood and Wine, thing. right? I think. Yeah, it's one of those two. Um, but yeah, I, I, now that I'm in post-production and I've kind of got... It basically will kind of motor along at a pretty steady pace. It's just when I'm only able to put an hour to an hour and a half in each day because I got other stuff to do. Whereas if I'm like, actually, you know what? This is just my day. My day is The Witcher 3. I think I'll get it done by the end of the year. But I also had this feeling of um, enjoying the process so much, I almost don't want to finish the video. Because <laughs> it's just no been so on. lovely. Like, I'm just going to dive into The Witcher 3 world for a little bit and edit and get lost in this. Like, oh, maybe I'll put that bit there or that bit there. So... Yeah, I don't know how I feel. Well, see, I wish I had that. Oh, I was just a big yeah, editor. You hate editing. Yeah, it's not my thing. So I'm thankful. Well, my final question was: You're able to play games. You mentioned you were doing F1 9 a.m. to 7 p.m. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I was doing that. It was crazy. I'm glad that's done. Sod that. And that's not even for a video. That was just to get the platinum myself. Yeah. Uh, Terrible. Drake game. died again. 
But I, I can't do that. I top, I tap out maximum, maximum four hours. Oh, I, could, I, can't play I, I could, I could play for, I could, I could play for like two days straight if I wanted to. Shoo. I've done multiple times where I've had to, where I've stayed up all night to get a trophy, basically. Just like, I, just, I don't know. I could just play for hours. I the only the only exception to that was just dance. Because just I've dance gave me so times. many wrist, wrist problems. Isn't that, isn't that the video of yours with a higher than average female audience? Yeah, yeah. And that, you know, <laughs> that, that tells they you. Say so I've died four times on this. Well, it's supposed to be a very simple platform <laughs> section. No, that's the section I was talking about. It's terrible. Yeah, <laughs> I don't. He keeps jumping backwards. All right, come on, Drake. Oh, I've just reached chapter ten. Oh, I'm not even out of six. I might have to do just the, dance. Um... Do it, Jax. Listen, if you beat the game, we're calling it there. <laughs> we'll go to the two-hour mark if you want, or eight p.m. We'll go to yeah. that as as a range. Yeah, but... Yeah, you never know. I might get stuck on a section so much I can't finish it. Possible. Yeah, my only hope is that oh. your power rock cuts out. Yeah, yeah, my internet goes. I always say if the internet goes, you know, the other one doesn't have to stop. <laughs> Which I'll definitely regret if that ever happens to me. <laughs> but um, hopefully it doesn't. I think I think John will just be glad he's not the only one who's taking a loss. Oh, I don't mind taking a loss. What this ha this has made me want to do though is uh play this again on my own time, just with all with everything on. <laughs> and the cutscenes. God forbid. Yeah. Nothing wrong with a cutscene skip here and there. My loss was respectable. Was it John? <laughs> what was the final score? 3-2? Three, 3-2, two. Uh, three, two, yeah. But that is respectful. Yeah, I'm going to have to say it's respectful because I, I lose 3-2 all the time. What is it to throw this damn grenade? Oh, not that. That would help if I had a grenade. <laughs> Trying to throw nothing at someone. Oh, well, that part, that part, that part sucks. Yeah, this part's that bad roof. as well. Yeah. Yeah. I'm crushing it. Well, it's crushing. Did you ever play on Brutal? No! That sounds terrible. It's, uh, honestly, I, the, my thing with Brutal was, I didn't actually think it was that bad if you've done crushing, because it was, it was basically, like, crushing was bad enough, they couldn't really make it any worse. Yeah. And then it was basically just like a crushing part two, really. Not not really a lot changed for it to be like, damn, this is way worse. I sometimes get asked if I do a, a bonus episode of Uncharted Drake's Fortune on Brutal. And all I can think is it's just, it'll be the same as just crushing playthrough, the same tough spots, the same yeah, exactly. strategies. It's really not that different. Be the same game as well. I think changes that also. I feel like it would just take a lot of time for something that doesn't need do it again. Oh, are there any videos you've worked on that really underperformed and but you kind of either don't Yeah, what's your if you make a video and you're proud of it, do you matter? Do you care about how well it did video view wise? Not massively. Uh, James asks for that all the time. Ugh. He asks for stats. Uh, no, he just asked if uh, I'm worried about my channel. It's like, nah, mate. Seg has all the game modifiers on. Oh, dear. Shame, shame this is a fresh save, so I don't even have them. I do like the, uh, the Jeep section. I think it's pretty cool. Uh, you don't know what I my think plan B is? My plan B is to just ride the wave, baby. 
<laughs> well, I imagine you're going to build up an awful lot of skills, video making wise. You're probably a, you're probably a better editor at your age than I was. So. Well, I, I mean, I don't like editing. It is that's not the route I'm going down. Bloody hell. <laughs> Honestly, I'm just gonna f ride the wave. Honestly, be like John, become a pro editor. I will not be editing outside of my own channel. I'll tell you that one for free. Is there ever anything when you finish video, and are you not all proud of some of the editing bits, or do you just view editing as a complete chore? I no, I'll be I'll be proud of it. I just won't be happy doing it. Basically, I do I do actually love it. I love going back to my um. I love watching my videos back. Mm. Like uh, I, I recently rewatched my Gran Turismo and COD videos, just because I, I haven't seen them in ages. I was like, I forgot I did that. Yeah, See, that's pretty that's cool. Fun. The archives. That's good. Ian. What I find nice is occasionally YouTube will recommend me on my own videos, because I've got my own personal accounts. I've got my channel account, but I've got my personal oh. account, which I. So I don't get like notifications on it. Yeah, I've got the I've got the same bloody thing. It was uh, it did yeah. me dirty the other day though. Jesus Christ! Well, so I was sat, sat here with with girlfriend right after telling her I don't do YouTube because if she watched my videos that'd be proper embarrassing. So I didn't say anything. So I go on YouTube, click the search bar, four of my videos pop up <laughs> with my thumbnail, and I, I was I was like, ah, how do I get out of this one? <laughs> just show her the Just Dance episode <laughs> that cannot happen <laughs> that cannot happen I said I said I said I said uh, I said I said next time I, next time I see her I'll show one if she wants but I'm not not watching the Just Dance one I can't watch that back. she went home she went home and watched them all you do know that I, I hopefully not so <laughs> I'm just gonna I'm just gonna hope you oh, how did you meet by the way I never asked uh, friend of a friend. Hey. Wait. That's nice. It? I love viewing the final product, but the process is eh. Don't dislike it, but it is a chore sometimes. I straight dislike it, mate. <laughs> really? I don't. I don't like listening or seeing myself all the time. Out here lying. Oh. Look, I was defending myself, man. I was defending myself. Okay. Just... Wasn't it wasn't a lie, it was just a sweet little <laughs> Don't look at the Just Dance video, that's all it was. <laughs> oh, I, don't, I think she'd be rare to go after seeing those Right, moves. no, I don't, I don't know I don't, don't know why you're telling me to tell her after she just saw my face on the screen four times. I think she knows, mate. You know what I mean? Don't think don't think I can say, Oh, that was just a that was just a, a one time <laughs> thing. See I was there four times. <laughs> You're dating someone who's famous. Be thankful. Yeah, exactly. Come on, I'll, I'll, I'll give you the lifestyle of no work one day. Draws. <laughs> Selling it to him. Oh, what's the thing? A wag? What would be the, what would be the other version of that? A wife and girlfriend of YouTuber? Um... Not so Scooby. Footballers have I get what you're saying, though. <laughs> I get what you're saying, but not a Scooby. Say, so, stay cool, mate. Like What's I a think, Scooby? I think Scooby. No, I just say, I say not Scooby is when you've got no idea. YouTuber oh, wag. Okay. Yeah, yeah. YouTuber wag. <laughs> S wag. <laughs> hey, I'll tell you what. Honestly, I should just I should let them know I had a, a, had a raid sponsorship. That will be the seller. You know, I once, I, I once, you know, did something for Raid Shadow Legends. Have you ever heard of it? Everybody's heard of Raid Shadow Legends. We've discussed this. There's a reason why everyone does it. They're apparently very nice to work with. They are very nice to work with, indeed. They love to give the cash. I have no idea how they're able to offer as much money as they do to a lot of people god knows but i'm not i'm, I'm not gonna complain like Goodness how much money does raid how much money does raid actually pull in every single i actually bet quite a bit yeah. to be fair i bet it's actually like pretty active 
I think the game itself is like actually probably booming. We just obviously wouldn't know that. Like mobile games are yeah, huge. Yeah, we're lame console gamers. Oh, I'm dead. Uh, I should be taking my time and just shoot all the barrels, but I'm... Yeah, I've just died to these barrels about 15 times. Yeah. Yeah, there will be there will definitely be individuals who drop like thousands of dollars, yeah. But... Cause with the mobile games, you can like buy yourself to be the best. You can literally just put money in and just be the greatest. So lots of people just do that. I paid five pounds uh... for Ronda Rousey in raid. No shame. <laughs> <laughs> I actually uh... unironically enjoyed playing raid as well. So when you're on camera time, I'm like, this is a good game. Like, I've played it, folks. It's it's pretty actually, actually I good. I actually did play it, yeah. I actually fully did play it. Played it for like a week later and then I stopped. <laughs> Had enough. Um, there's a WWE professional wrestler called Randy Orton. And he paid a kid. So, so, hang on a minute. To... Hang on a minute. Let me, let me restart you then. Why did you just presume I didn't know who one of the greatest wrestlers of all time was? I know. Sorry, I didn't. I didn't mention Logan Paul. No, <laughs> yeah, you know Randy Orton second. Come on now. I actually love Randy Orton. <laughs> okay. Uh, so he paid <laughs> some like teenager to get him to max level in Elden Ring, so he could just run around and smash dudes <laughs> and not, not be challenged by the bosses. Because I don't have time for that. I just want to run around. Can you uh, just get me a high level? <laughs> what a guy. How much did it cost him? Uh, I, don't know. I think he said he gave the guy a grand. Oh my god. Fair dude. Yeah, just, just, just max level the Marine Elden Ring. Has Randy not heard of modding? Yeah, he, he's got morals, James. He's a good guy. Yeah. To be fair, if he is on PC, though, he definitely should have just done that. But... but I also feel like if he's paying someone to play Elden Ring, he's probably up on a console anyway. Yeah, I don't think Randy Orton's a tech-savvy dude. When the world needed you most, you weren't there. What do you mean, James? What are you talking about? <laughs> I'm everywhere, mate. Roman and can't be far off. Whoa! Even on Explorer, you really can't run by enemies, can you? I have to see you get bopped in face then. Straight slapped. You could have paid to level him. Yeah, mate, I, I would not have a fun time leveling an Elden Ring. No chance. It's even a route to level up in Elden Ring. The kid definitely did mod it, though. Imagine. Modded it ah, for two I seconds did. and then paid him. <laughs> I was like, cheers, Randy. <laughs> cheers, man. Not suspicious at all that I did it in, you know, 35 minutes, but... But I imagine oh, someone man. like uh, Randy Orton is not very tech savvy to mod his own games. Let's just find Sullivan and get the hell out he made a big uh, return there recently. I saw that actually. Yeah. He was out for like a year and a half. Had to get neck fusion or something like that, or spine fusion. Honestly, they all have to go through something at some point, eh? No one ever comes out scape free. Uh, one of the wrestlers, his name was Kevin Nash, he said there's only two things that are real in wrestling. The miles and the money. Yeah. And by the miles, like the miles you put in your body, the miles you put in the road. The miles you put in your brain with the choreography. Yeah, I still don't know how to keep it all. I know some of them are like, oh, we'll call them the ring. I'm like, how? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> Doesn't make sense. Then... Like, it's I've like watched... A... Um... One. Did you? I saw you know Logan Paul and Rey Mysterio. They both messed up when Rey almost hit his head. Yeah, yeah. Floor, Rey was short, and Logan because he was so short. Logan should just left me with a landed fine. But your instinct kicks in, and you don't realize until it's too late. Ah, oh, I would have been better off just left him be. Yeah, exactly. But, but... that's Rey Mysterio, who's been doing it forty years, and he's like, ah, mess that. Yeah, so he's caught him. Pretty crazy, but they both messed up. So I, I, you know, I only thought it was one of them, but it was both of them. Next. Yeah. 
I also I've watched some matches that are 30 minutes, 40 minutes. One I watched that was 70 minutes. I'm going, how do you, how do you do this? Like you can't possibly go over something in the back. I'm like okay, so 60 minutes in, when you do a moon salt, I'm going to do this. Like how I I don't know how they keep it in their head. Honestly, uh, uh, there's no way they like fully rehearse it every day though. Oh, they could do, no. but could you imagine like every single day doing 70 minutes of wrestling? I don't know, well, most matches are like 10 or 12. Mm. And I think, especially in like WWE, they've got their spots. You know, like John Cena always had his five moves. And every wrestler knew how he's going to do his moves. I'll, I'll get in a position for his moves. <laughs> I'll let it happen. Yeah. Uh, I think it was uh, even The Rock said he was on a your man Joe Rogan's podcast recently. It was a terrible appearance because The Rock will never say anything controversial. He can't, not anymore. But uh, he said in wrestling, you don't ever beat anyone. They just let. Oh jeez, I died again. People let you beat them. Like they actually lie down for you for three seconds. It's like you must thank them at the end of it and don't be an asshole about it. That's true. I mean, they don't decide if they win. Really, a bit sad. Yeah. <coughs> I'm getting smashed. How is this explorer? I wonder, I wonder how many. Is my headset gonna die? Right it is. Find another way in. Scope things out. I wonder uh, how many people have been tempted to put a bet on themselves and they know they're gonna win. <coughs> oh, I'd be telling. I'd be telling the some long distant cousin twice removed. We're like. Psh, Put six grand on the other guy. <laughs> Honestly, I would. Because realistically, you know, why wouldn't you? Uh, isn't it? They did start to bring it in, didn't they? Professional wrestling betting. You can bet on who's going to win the Royal Rumble. Uh, oh, no, there's definitely a bet. There's definitely. You can bet on every sport somewhere. Every, there's no doubt what about is... it. There's some website <laughs> somewhere. <laughs> But it's not a sport. I class it as a sport. <laughs> it's a, it's a live action stunt performance. Look, yeah, yeah, but Adam, let me. Uh, this is this is my biggest argument. Can you do what they do? No. Do you reckon if you train for a year, you could do what they do? <clears throat> Some of them. Some of them. Mm. You you should check out independent wrestling. Some of those guys are dreadful. <laughs> I'm I'm am talking Logan Paul here. But Logan Paul is like a former wrestler, like you know, amateur wrestler and proper athletic. Yeah, so my mate, I once wrestled the kid in school. <laughs> you know what I mean? Shit, you should see me play the WWE games. <laughs> Uh, could I do... Okay, I get where you're going with your argument. But there's an awful lot of things that I can't do. For example, I'm not great at knitting. But is knitting a sport? Oh, Actually, I take that back. I take that back. <laughs> at a certain level, yes, it is. <laughs> it definitely can be. <laughs> but I, 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 I class a sport something that, that's... Especially at high level, something that's very taxing on your body, and WWE is extremely taxing on your body. You got a point, Steak. You really do. There's no. I just. Just because it's predetermined doesn't mean that they don't have to do 15 acrobatic flips. They don't have to jump around, all this, all that. That's a spot. If WWE's not a spot, I think gymnastics isn't a spot. Because a gymnastics is the means... same thing and also predetermined. <laughs> How's gymnastics predetermined? Because you know, in gymnastics, when you go up to the stage, you know exactly what flips you're going to do. So you know your routine. It's like dancing. Dancing, you know your routine. Ah. So if you know your routine okay. in wrestling, but those are sports, then surely they're not sports. But the outcome isn't predetermined. Well, it is if you fall on your ass. <laughs> it's a straight loss. <laughs> but that being said, just because... They've still got to do it. They've still got to make it look believable that either of them can win. So, 
Yeah, but sport is normally competition. Well, it is a competition. You know, but going into it, you don't know who's going to win and lose. That's what makes the sport but interesting. But that's, that's, that's not necessarily really just sport, though. You can. It's like. Can you name? But you can. You can name the same thing about about uh, football. You can't. Some people don't win in football. Yeah, but how do I put it? Professional wrestling, they know who's going to win before the match starts. That yeah. is why it's not a sport. But you could call it athletic. But, but I not also a sport. don't think I also don't think the result can determine if it's a sport or not. I think the result is just the result of the sport, not the result doesn't make it a sport. Because if you if you go and play football in your back garden with your brother. Right, uh, and you and and so you know when you've got a big brother and a little brother, and the big brother's always uh, going to let the little one win. They know who's going to win. Yeah. So is that a sport? <laughs> no, it's it just called being nice to children. But you're also playing the sport. Is the point here? Okay, even if you're messing about in the back garden. Yeah, that's still a sport. You're kicking a football around. It's physical activity. Hmm. I, 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 it's the predetermined nature of it that kind of, I'm willing to say it's athletic, and it's impressive, and it's, oftentimes more entertaining than what, I would classify. I, I would I, professional wrestling is more entertaining in an awful lot of circumstances than actual mixed martial arts. If we were to legitimately fight, it's not as entertaining. But I still is my other question: Does that mean you class the UFC as a sport? A uh, mixed martial arts is sport, yeah. Because some people argue that UFC is predetermined, even though it's not. But I mean, for those who think it is, does that mean UFC wouldn't be a sport if it was predetermined? If they really do think so, they've got bigger problems than. <laughs> yeah. But that's what I'm saying. If if it was predetermined, would you class it as a sport? Here we go. Uh, no. Even if you scissor kicking someone in the draw. That's the reason why you know. Fixing fights is such a big problem. Fixing, or right, what was the, what's in basketball? Shaving points is that the expression? Shaving points. Can't say I've ever heard of shaving points. It's when our referees are in on the take and they sort of they're a bit more lenient for one team than the other. I mean, that's in every sport ever, though. That's, it, that's <laughs> it. I'm not being funny, but football it happens every single match. You know what I mean? Mr. John Callum will tell you about that. But that's that's more of a thing in. But it definitely is a thing though. Like, I I remember I watched a bit of a Chicago basketball against Utah, and oh my god, the amount of fouls that got called was actually a joke. It actually made me physically mm. angry. But just because the referee was trying to predetermine it doesn't mean it's not a sport. I think we'll have to agree to disagree, but you make one hell of a... Maybe a lawyer should be your future job. I actually... I actually... Lawyer would be my dream job, to be fair. If I wasn't doing YouTube. But I yeah. also am too lazy of a person to go and spend four years in education just to do a job. Well, you've watched every episode of Suits, you know? You got oh, your yeah, foundation. I could definitely make up some sort of waffle for, for, a, for a lawyer. But Suits is very good though. Very good TV show. I bet it's very realistic uh, as well. Yeah. I also feel very stupid at the moment. Uh, you supposed to... Did you turn one of the chains around? Yeah, I did. It's over there. Yeah, go... <laughs> you climb up the train and then go left. <laughs> I like the way sometimes it's... Oh, you could absolutely jump there, but we don't want you to, so... You can't. Fair, James has just Dude. said I could waffle for England, so I should go into sales. Don't know what he means by that. Oh, I, it? I, it's not. It, it's not waffling. It's good arguments, mate. It's called a debate, James. You, you should. You should I, buy these because yeah, should, it, it, it's a debate <laughs> between between two friends, James. If you don't know what a debate is, I recommend the debate club in university. If they've got one, I reckon you'd do right there. Join debate society. Exactly, that's what I'm saying. But I couldn't debate with a stranger, though. That would just do my head in. 
Because mm. I feel and like you if are you, a master of if, nah, if you're debating with a stranger, you don't, you don't know who they are, so you don't know if they're just like they're just being a dick. Basically. Are you also don't know if they're actually getting annoyed and offended? Exactly. To kind of put up. Yeah, we're yeah. A friend is like you know, it's just a. You know. Don't take it seriously. Yeah, it's just a nice little talk, but with a stranger, they could be sat there in the head saying, "Why is this guy such a pillar?" I'm a member. Thank you. Damn, James, James has joined the debate society. He'll be a master debater. Okay, then. Oh, a bit interesting. <laughs> interesting way to. to... <laughs> um, that being said, James, how many attractive women is there there for you to turn up? <laughs> what? You know what I mean? Because I don't think I don't think James is doing it out of the good of doing a debate. <laughs> you know what I mean? I think there is some <laughs> alternative motive for this. Where the hell do I go here? <laughs> James's priorities. <laughs> Thought this would be over before the Man U Chelsea game, but 30 minutes to kick off. Mate, it, oh, we, we'll, we were we'll going for then. two hours, mate. We're going for another 12 minutes, oh! all right? Calm you. Calm you. Calm it. <laughs> One, the President Resta Law students. And Seg, I'm a retired man. Don't believe it. <laughs> retired from what, mate? Retired from saying you retired or what? Can't retire at the age of like 18 or 19, whichever one you are. Oh boy. Even though your fake ID will probably say 25. What a fake ID that was, God. There's only 22 chapters and you're on chapter 15. Yeah. You know, There's no way you could get this done under two and a half hours. I probably, I probably wouldn't have done this run because when I died, when you die, if you if you restart checkpoints before you die, you, the timer doesn't edit. Um, and I've died quite a bit, but because it's like an actual like it's a one v one type uh... speed run, I've I've not reset. So if you reset your deaths and reset sections, that went awfully. It's definitely doable. Oh, now I get you. Um. And obviously, there's like, yeah, I'm also very rusty at the game. I haven't played it in a while. Woo! That being said, also speaking about WWE, I'll be playing WWE on stream tomorrow, boys. Fun fact. Hell yeah! As a mutual game, bit of WWE action. I have to remember to put those games on download. It's downloading five games every night's a problem. Who knows coming on tomorrow? A guy called Doco Bell. Exactly, it's all Paul Lightness. Oh yeah, tomorrow I'll be I'll be on early as well because I've got bloody. Um, I'm at the dentist tomorrow for Christ's sake. Stupid dentist. You're gonna tell me my wisdom teeth are coming through, and I'll be like, I know, mate. You're not taking them out, or else I'll kick you. When's Platinum All right, I've on? just made... What's this? Right, I've just made the chapter 10, Seg. Woo! What do you want? Uh, 16. Whoa! <laughs> um, when's Adam <laughs> McDermott coming on? I don't know. You might have to ask him that one. It's whenever he's available. Ah, that guy's lame. <laughs> Honestly. He strikes me as the type of guy who in a minute 40 will be at chapter 10 in Uncharted 1. <laughs> I mean... <laughs> So you have to make chapter 17 before 8pm. Yeah, I'm rooting for you. Oh, Jesus. Now that section is also an annoying section. <sighs> yeah. I'm glad the trophy community is dying. You guys all copy each other and make everything so cringe. Um, I don't want to be that guy, but, but your name's the trophy beaver. <laughs> How do you feel when you see um, criticism like that? Do you kind of think, oh, is there a little bit of truth to it, or do you feel, oh, it's way off base? I mean, people definitely copy each other, but, I mean, it's really, there's only so much to do around a particular niche. It's like people copy each mm -hmm. other all the time for videos. But that being said, 
I mean, the only time I don't like it is when there's someone who definitely like isn't wouldn't have done platinums if it wasn't for YouTube. That's when it annoys me. If if YouTube's the only reason they're doing trophies, that's when I get annoyed. But but most of the guys who did trophies beforehand. Bro, you telling me yeah. you're the first person to ever do a trophy list review? Is that what Beaver's done? He just doubted himself. Crazy. <laughs> I don't mind. Either way, it's good content for me. There's so many games that... Um... To be fair, John does have a point. Trophy list reviews and, you know, that is a... That's definitely a plat bro thing. Is he the first person to do one? I think he was, right? Three quarters of them yeah. wouldn't have done trophies if it wasn't for views. That's true. But What's going on? I don't know, James. My channel's been pretty normal, other than the odd outlier. I think the only one that's not done well as I thought it would is Assassin's Creed Mirage. I don't know. I think my channel's been pretty fine. The game has just spawned me in and died. What the hell? The troll fed us over and Nick's own one banging views like normal oh, rest of the clones are dead. Oh my. I, I uh, I'm not really I'm, yeah, I'm not really abreast of it all, so what's going on? Uh the, I mean views have definitely fallen off for some, but it's not like a everyone thing. Yeah. Like people are still Still getting the views they normally would. I get the views I normally do. The only the only outliers is obviously my sports videos do better than most. My UFC mm -hmm. video would have done the the same as my other sports videos, but someone jumped the gun on it without the platinum, so they banged like ninety k views. So I think that affected Oof. UFC quite a bit. Yeah, um, and they didn't get the platinum, so that annoyed me. But gosh, John, there's no need to out the poor guy. Jesus Christ, mate. Name, name bombing and everything. But either way, no matter no matter what happens, I'll bloody, I'll still I'll still play, I'll still get trophies regardless. Even if I have to get a job, I'm still gonna sink get all my trophies in games. That's not gonna stop. Yeah. Just, it's just fun to to make it what I want to do. For the time being, I'll actually just take a few years off getting an actual job. Oh yeah, why not? Has there been a shift away from um it feels, I don't know, maybe from what I've seen. Maybe just I'm I'm being recommended different things. But the sort of this game took my soul is kind of, that kind of thing is dying down a bit. It's not quite so exaggerated as it used to be. I I think so. I I've seen more positive titles than ever. It's still yeah. the odd person that does it. But I've, uh, I don't know. I feel like I stick the same. To be fair, I've not, I've not changed mine. But I know quite a few people have. I'm trying to see if I can remember doing these. Uh, Whoop! By heart, this puzzle. Oh my god, I'm dying. Crouch, Drake, you numpty. I platinum outlast, and it made me want to eat my own dick up. You could have said cut, John. Come on. Like at least make it somewhat PG. Bloody hell. I have to say eat i don't know i wouldn't say i i'd say my content's pretty much the exact same as other trophy hunters i just don't do the same games demonetized well john i see it is hey, i'm not gonna lie i'm not gonna lie now this this whole area of the game is single-handedly the worst part of uncharted one i think i hate this bit so much wait which one but all the this bit with all the bloody maze shenanigans See where I'm at? <laughs> this bit. I love this section. I love it. I remember how many times. I, I, know, I know it now, but back when I first started, bloody hell, I got lost so many times. But I'm not going to lie to you. I'm happy to call it there because I'd rather not do this section. <laughs> oh. <laughs> you, you can take a nice breather and a, yeah, I can have a good think for yourself. Yeah, you could actually run a, out the clock. A four minute, a four minute <laughs> chat, real quick. <laughs> uh, 
Are you going to get Avatar? Probably not. I, I was hoping Ubisoft would send me a code, but um, I don't think they will. Um, I've got a feeling. Dude, I'm in the Ubisoft Creators program, but it seems pretty bloody useless because they've given me not, no games from it. I mean, wait. Hang on a minute. I'm like, there's no way my pass will come today, right? I need to track this real quick. Oh, boy. Um. Parcel's due tomorrow. Sweet. Right. Um. I can do I can make Adam's screen slightly bigger as well. <laughs> oh, the live light on him. Oh dear, I don't want that. That turret's annoying Whoa. as well as well. Go on. God. Who's this fuck? Yeah, I won't buy Avatar release. I spent too much money on Christmas presents personally. Um I just love giving presents, me. <laughs> Are you a big Christmas guy, Adam? I like it. What I quite like in my own home city is to put up all the Christmas lights and I like kind of grabbing a friend or two and then chilled out in a pub, a nice cozy pub. Bar hop like three to four places at the most. Just be chill and, well not chill, be cozy. A bunch of Irish bars tend to have fires in them, a little fireplace. Mm -hmm. So I like it. I just love everything Christmas, me. Favourite think... Christmas movies? Favourite Christmas movie? Number one is Nativity. That is the best Christmas movie ever. Don't know if you know what it is over in Ireland. Uh, I will look it up. I feel like I feel Sounds... it's, it's it's only like a, I think it's only people in the UK will know Nativity. It's like basically it sounds quite bad, but it's actually a lot. But it's like a it's like a, a comedy of sort of like a primary school doing a Nativity. Like they they do a Nativity play and they made a movie about a school making a Nativity play. It sounds pretty stale, but it's actually like extremely good. Basically, it's a lot. It's very funny. Look, okay, he's taking in the view for the last minute. Yeah. David Tennant. This'll, this'll that's do. that's not till like Nativity two or three, James. Talk about the first one here. But in terms of Christmas movie you've heard of, probably Home Alone. Oh, there we go. No. Home Alone's unbelievable. Or uh, the Polar Express as well. Even though that used to scare the life out of me when they went to the puppet section. Gosh, look at that. Look at that view. Look at that view of Uncharted. Oh. Yeah, there we go. Oh, you said... I think... I think I might have just won. Just, 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 just slightly. Still. Just, just, slightly. Just, just a little. But, as I always say, it's not about the win, it's about the... Uh, the fun time. I did the whole. Yeah, look at that. Yeah, let's whole... see if I can um, turn off my HUD. Do we see? Yeah, it's like the, screen did the two hours as usual. Did the two hours that I usually go for? Yeah. Well, wow, you can't turn off your HUD. No, I can't. Wait. Photo mode? What's that? Photo mode. Is it turned off? Oh. <laughs> 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 The there you go, yeah. folks. <laughs> <laughs> what a view. What a view. Uh, how do we zoom in a bit? Oh, gosh, uh, you get uh, deep into the photo right here. Look. How do you zoom in? How do you, like, move the camera forward? Three wins? That was my second win. W Club? I think so. I think it was a blast. It's the it most relaxing yeah, one, that's for sure. A nice little run through Uncharted instead of having to jump between six different games where I get battered each time. No, I mean, oh my god, oh, I just saw his eyeballs then. <laughs> yeah, uh, that'll do. That'll yeah, do. that'll be uh, that'll be us calling it Seg Shed exactly. Uh, I appreciate everyone watching. Uh, anyone who's liked the stream, anyone chilling. If anyone who doesn't know Adam, just go check his channel. That's pinned at the top. Even though you probably know who he is. Let's be honest. Let's be honest here. Um, but it was good fun, a bit of Uncharted, I haven't played it in ages. So, yeah, everyone, make sure you have a good night and seg, seg me up for Christmas.
Jesse. Got anything to say, Adam, before I end? Bye, folks. This has been nice. Yeah. Right. I will catch you all tomorrow at 10 a.m. UK time. I think it is 10 a.m. Because I've got to go to the dentist at 2. So I've got to start early, for goodness sake. But yeah. Appreciate you all. Peace out.